It's Tuesday, May the 5th, and we are in Medjidea at Vasilika's church, where he printed 7,000 copies of Bernie Korselman's book. And this is the first day that they began to be distributed first to the leaders, and then the leaders will take them to different villages and among the people of Romania, sharing the book with uh, believers in uh, their many churches. They have a great fellowship and many projects going here. First, the first year for this greenhouse. And he's the owner. Yeah, and the Vasile. owner is Vasile standing there, and this is his wife over here. And her name is? Julia. Julia, good to meet you. And uh, we're also happy for this young pastor, <laughs> and his name is Rado, and I'm shaved. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you should see and me. so they're they're going to be thrilled with their tomatoes. So far, we have tomatoes, right? Uh, uh, pepper, peppers, peppers. and uh, cucumbers. Oh, good diversity. So this is uh, one of the cows from the cow project in previous years. We're pleased to see it again. In this house church meeting, the people were so open with one another to receive testimonies, prayer requests, pray for one another, and they received the word of God I preached. It's May 6th on Wednesday, and we visited the second greenhouse. So here's a second new greenhouse. It was just built a couple of weeks ago. It's very hot inside, so hot I had to step outside or it would steam up my camera. You can see it's pretty good size. Yeah, this is the family that, that are operating it right here. In the evening, I preached at Pastor Basilica's church in Medjugorje. And the people really responded to my message on God's revelation. And we had a great time of prayer and seeking the Lord around the altar. On Thursday, May the 7th, we visited this pastor in Mongolia and arranged for him to have a project. His wife is going to have a new sewing machine and not only earn money for her family, but train others for the glory of God. We were able to attend a prayer and fasting meeting in school missions, and I uh, got to share the word with them and we had a great time in our seating. gentleman came forward for prayer. The next day, on Friday, May 8th, I, I spoke at the school of missions on spiritual disciplines. And then we went out to the different projects, once again, seeing this new greenhouse, very well built with steel frame and producing uh, crops already uh, with several different kinds of plants, vegetables planted this spring. The next project well, this is, is just not one quite finished, it's another not greenhouse, complete, but, but it will be uh, done within the, the next week or so. In the evening service I preached in Tortumam, and I was able to preach on judging correctly. This gentleman came to repent. On Saturday, May 9th, we visited the last two greenhouses, and they were done very well. They're not quite finished, but we were happy to see them nearly completed and the people were really thrilled to get these greenhouses and they plan on producing a lot of vegetables to use for the family and to sell and to share with others. In the evening service we were in Darbani and I was able to preach the words, the people, and they responded. Twenty of them came forward to repent and to get right with the Lord Jesus. Praise the Lord the prayer time. This was another fruitful mission. I preached eight times, twenty came for repentance, visited all the projects from September 2014, funded a sewing machine, two more greenhouses, six beehives, and a used clothing shop for a total of $4,500.